Hi, my name's Marc-Andre Pichette, and today I'm here to talk about StarTech fittings. Inspired by the TechQ's gold mine in Kirkland Lake, Ontario, the StarTech fitting creates an impenetrable seal, helping to ensure protection of electrical connections from water and dirt, even in the most inhospitable conditions. From its humble beginnings, the product has evolved into a leading product in the marketplace. That evolution continues today with this new 90-degree version of the fitting. It's a sophisticated product that starts with a 5,000-year-old process, metal casting, which is done at ABB's Saint-Rémy facility. Marc Olivier Britton is the production manager here. Marc Olivier, what happens here at the facility? Our facility creates a wide range of cast products. Casting metal isn't very high tech, but it is one of the most cost efficient and above all sustainable ways to produce certain products, including the 90 degree bend on the new StarTech fitting. The foundry was established in 1932. However, Saint Remy has been making sand molded castings for over 40 years. With a team of 15 employees, we manufacture several components for a number of products that are very popular with our customers, such as the StarTech fittings, Iberville FS boxes, and AMC fittings, which are made from locally sourced aluminum. Let's go take a look. Let's go. The process begins here, where Sylvain is creating a sand cast mold. Using a mixture composed of sand, water, and bentonite, he creates a template of what will become eight individual fitting parts. To this mold, he adds preformed sand cores that compose the interior of the parts being casted. These cores are created in a separate process which requires an auxiliary machine to heat cure a sand mixture into its final form. Now the mold is closed up, compressed, and it's ready to be filled. Aluminum ingots are heated in the furnace to a temperature of 750 degrees Celsius. Yvon, the foundry's master pourer, wears protective gear that protects him from the radiant heat and molten splash. He's extremely careful as he carries the 40-pound ladle and fills the molds with aluminum. The molds are left to cool for a few minutes and then they're dropped into this vibrating table. The shakeout process frees the solidified metal from the sand it was cast in. Using a bandsaw, the eight parts are cut apart from the runner and the gates. The rough edges are ground off and we now have the cast 90 degree fitting. But this is only the first step in becoming a StarTech fitting. The rest of the process happens at another ABB facility located in saint jean sur richelieu ABB has a number of facilities in rural areas across Canada. Most of these facilities have been in operation for long periods and are important employers in the local communities. The St. Jean facility has been continuously manufacturing the well-known Iberville boxes that house light switches and plugs for over 100 years, amongst many other products. It also manufactures the entire range of StarTech fittings. It's here that the 90-degree fitting cast in saint -Rémy will get its finishing touches. The fitting is set in a custom jig that allows it to be mounted in this lathe. It's then machined to add threads to both extremities and a groove on one of the endings. Once done, it's cleaned to remove machining oils and lubricants. From here, the final assembly is completed manually. It's at this station that the grounding ring, thermoplastic rubber bushings, retaining ring, gland nut and sealing gaskets are added. The finished parts are boxed and shipped to our Bromont Distribution Center for shipment to distributors and customers in oil and gas, mining and utility segments, among many others. Born out of necessity in the harsh environment of a gold mine, the StarTech fitting has evolved into an extensive lineup of customer-oriented products that have become one of the industry benchmarks for safety, quality construction, and ease of installation. See you soon. Mm -hmm.